A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. In the time of King Herod, after Jesus was born in Bethlehem of Judea, wise men from the east came to Jerusalem asking, Where is the child who has been born King of the Jews? For we observed his star at its rising and have come to pay him homage. When King Herod heard this, he was frightened and all Jerusalem with him. And calling together all the chief priests and scribes of the people, he inquired of them where the Messiah was to be born. They told him in Bethlehem of Judea. For so it has been written by the prophet, And you, Bethlehem, in the land of Judah, are by no means least among the rulers of Judah. For from you shall come a ruler who is to shepherd my people Israel. Then Herod secretly called for the wise men and learned from them the exact time when the star had appeared. Then he sent them to Bethlehem saying, Go and search diligently for the child. And when you have found him, bring me word so that I may also go and pay him homage. When they had heard the king, they set out. And there, ahead of them, went the star that they had seen at its rising until it stopped over the place where the child was. When they saw that the star had stopped, they were overwhelmed with joy. On entering the house, they saw the child with Mary, his mother, and they knelt down and paid him homage. Then opening their treasure chests, 
they offered him gifts of gold frankincense and myrrh and having been warned in a dream not to return to herod they left for their own country by another road a very pleasant evening to you all mm. today the biblical figure is a star and also we have a theme to reflect upon that is lightening the darkness of our sinful life first of all i would like to ask you a question what does the star symbolizes absolutely the christmas star symbolizes the star of bethlehem which according to the biblical perspective guided the three kings so called wise men to the baby baby jesus who had born this star also have the heavenly sign of prophecy that which fulfilled long ago and the shining hope for all of us if you look into the old testament book of numbers chapter 24 verses 15 to 19 says a star will come out of jacob a scepter will arise out of israel now let us see the biblical perspective if we look into the gospel we can clearly see that how the star helped and guided the three kings so called wise men the star that brightened and dispelled the darkness of the world by its mere shining presence that which resembles the jesus who had born the father made a light for his son that is jesus who had born already as the wise men near to the star at certain time it disappeared from their sight in the same way if you look into our lives when our focus disappears from god our life also darkens there was no light to follow yet they did not lose their hope with the zeal they dare to speak the herald and move on as soon as the kings left their herald's presence the star reappeared till they reached the birthplace of jesus in the same way when we are led by the baby jesus who had born in our hearts our mother church and its teachings and mostly the teachings of jesus that is the love our hearts experiences the deep joy as well as the powerful desire to meet the baby jesus who had born before jesus born the whole world filled with darkness and full of sin and error and even till today the star still arising there with with its mere shining presence that represents the jesus who had born and came to this world to vanish the sin in which we are living and the star reminds us to repent for our darkness of sinful life and with the brightness of christmas star and to focus on the christmas christian virtues like love forgiveness mercy compassion and helping others all these are stars stars for us which can help to follow jesus and to meet the jesus who had born the five pointed star represents the five wounds of jesus 
on the cross and the heart that full of love for all of us and the cross symbolizes the death of jesus so that everyone's sins would be forgiven my dear brothers as we are preparing for the birth of jesus let us all recall the sinful life that we lived and let us prepare ourselves in such a way so that jesus would be born in our hearts by brightening our hearts joyful way thank you Lord, our merciful Father, we pray for all the sinners in the world. Lord, let your light of mercy shine on them like a star, so that they may have the brightness and live a life according to your will. For this, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear our prayer. Lord. In this precious moment, we pray for the grandfather of my friend, who is suffering from major hemostroke, hem hemorrhage stroke, caused due to the bleeding in the brain, and is suffering severely in the hospital. Lord, touch him, heal him. With your gracious power, for this let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear our prayer. Lord, forgive us our sins, which we have committed in our lives, consciously, unconsciously, or subconsciously. Forgive all of them, and we ask you pardon. For this, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear our prayer. Can we let us be on our knees? Before we say, "Our Father," let us thank the Father who had loved this world and gave His only Son for all of us. And say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, 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 and fulfilled the will of god and gave us the jesus into our hearts and into our lives to be with him to live with him hail mary full of grace the lord is with you blessed are you among women and blessed is the fruit of your womb jesus holy mary mother of god pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death amen hail mary Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, now and ever shall it be, world without end. Amen. Let us pray. A diamond shines no brighter than that lovely Christmas star. It shines in all its brilliance. It's seen from near and far, a symbol of the Christ child as he lays upon the hay. It tells to all the waiting world a king was born that day. O Bethlehem star, 
keep shining give us faith and hope and love keep our thoughts forever turning to the savior up above give us strength and courage to our best and never falter in our faith as we watch the christmas star we make our prayer through christ our lord amen the lord be with you and with your spirit may almighty god bless you the father and the son and the holy spirit amen let us bless the lord thank you lord in number x3 on page number 3 Stand by the world we heard To the world we all must grow Nourished by the bread of life To the world we go All together in one love and pain Seeking ever to be true You will guide us on the path to love Of eternal being With our joys and with our cares To the world we all must go Wave by toil but raised by hope To the world we go All together in one love and faith Seeking ever to be true You will guide us on the path alone Of eternal being